This weather report brought to you by Seesaw, a better way to grow. Tonight's 7 News headlines, police have shot a man who allegedly pulled a knife on officers in Matraville. Tonight, he's undergoing emergency surgery. Inflation has hit a 32-year high, the cost of living rising by 7.3% in the last quarter. And Medibank Private has confirmed the data of all customers has been compromised in its cyber attack. Now, here's Angie with Sydney's Weather. Thank you, Mark. Well, what a day. It felt a lot like summer and there's plenty more sunshine to look forward to in the week ahead. Today, not only fine, but I'm seasonably warm in the CBD. 29 degrees, that is seven above the October average. Those warm northwesterly winds made it all the way to the coast, so there wasn't much temperature variation from east to west. 29 the top at Penrith, Parramatta and Manly. It's only a small pocket on the south coast that continue to see really severe weather this afternoon. Warnings for severe storms in that zone have now been lifted. The rest of the state remains quite settled. Tomorrow, a trough will move across the state, bringing a couple of brief showers or storms before quickly moving offshore. A ridge of high pressure then remains, allowing us to head into the weekend without anything too eventful. Around the capitals, Brisbane, just a shower, a possible storm, but mostly fine, 32 degrees. Similar conditions for Canberra. Showers for Melbourne and Adelaide. Rain for Hobart. Nice and settled for Perth and Darwin. Statewide tomorrow, a dry and sunny day in the far west. As that trough tracks across the state, we could well see more showers and storms through the eastern half. Daytime temperatures will again be above average along the coast, especially 29 degrees at Coffs Harbour and 28 for Newcastle. For the metro region, a sunny morning. We could see a passing shower late in the day, even an evening storm. Tops won't be quite as summery, but still well above average. Temperatures to reach the mid-20s for the most part, getting up to 27 at Penrith. On the water, northwesterly winds will run at 10 to 15 knots at first, increasing to 20 knots offshore by late evening, tending westerly. Seas looking more manageable, sitting at about 1.5 metres. It is a mostly clear night in the CBD, with a balmy low of 17 ahead. Tomorrow should bring a sunny morning. We may see that afternoon shower or storm and a top of 25 degrees. Ahead, we finish the working week on Friday with settled conditions. The weekend also shaping up very nicely. Lots of sunshine. Monday, particularly warm, 31 degrees in the CBD and our west. Then just a passing shower or two possible for Tuesday and Wednesday. Very light, if anything, but that's looking pretty good, Mark. Looking very, very good, Ange. Thank you. That is 7 News for this Wednesday. We'll have updates for you throughout the evening. I'm Mark Ferguson from all the team. I hope you have a great night.